Tonight we are seeing how one particular group of people in need, homeless moms, are getting help in Marion County. The charity in Ocala was founded more than a decade ago because there was nowhere for those women to turn. Now, supported by law enforcement, it's getting results together for 60 moms and kids at a time, all living together in the same community, too. It's a very cool story. News 6's Eric Von Aiken went to see it and the results. I used to live right here in this apartment right here at the bottom. This is Janine Ross's past. This Northeast Ocala apartment complex was her home with her children for the past year, and it is entirely the reason, she says, she now has a future. I was doing narcotics, um, and I was not taking care of myself or let alone loving my life or my kids the way I should. So being here gave me a open up a, a new life for me. What you're seeing here is what the ladies live in. April McDonald runs the complex known as Hope Villas. She is the executive director of Project Hope, a faith-based charity founded in Marion County to care for homeless women with children. They come from shelters, domestic violence shelters, emergency shelters off the street, living on a couch with family. Um, and they come literally sometimes with their children and one bag. And we give them new beds, all the furnishings, everything they need to start. Just anything you would need to start up with a new home. Um, with the whole goal of them becoming self-sufficient. For as long as 18 months, Project Hope takes care of the children, giving them a stable, safe place to stay. You want to get on and make sure it fits you? And everything they need to live like any other kid. Are you currently homeless and needing shelter? While getting mom back on her feet and set for success. Budgets and everything. So it's, it's amazing what they do. Like they really, they really push you to be the woman that you are already in on the inside. And I love it. The Marion County Sheriff's Office and the Ocala Police Department both strongly support Project Hope. Oh, I see a smile on your face today. Last month, giving away gifts to all of the children. And donors pay for the housing and career training and life skills that the ladies are learning. But they leave with everything. So all the donations that were given to them out of the goodness of people's hearts, they leave with so that they're not starting over again. Janine has now left her past behind and doesn't look back, only looking to the future. I got my CDLs and I'm going to go get my first truck soon. You, you're going to drive a truck? Yeah. I drive school buses right now for the school board of Marion County. So. How awesome. We wish you luck. Thank you. Project Hope was founded here in Marion County in 2006, and back then the founders made a promise to themselves that they would serve women here first. They'll consider anyone from anywhere if there is room, but consistently Project Hope has a wait list of some 50 people at any given time. In Marion County, Eric Von Anken getting results together, New 6. What a blessing. And yeah. 18 months is the time that you need to get back on your feet. To, you Plenty know, of time. Yes, yeah. absolutely. Good stuff.